Knock knock, it's Knuckles! And I am so sorry for the delay on this video. See, I ended up having a really busy week last week. And, um, unfortunately I wasn't able to make this episode. But, I am able to now. So, sorry again for the delay. I had a lot of work to do. And on top of that, I finally got to film again with my friends Troy and Chris. Who I have not been able to see since the beginning of quarantine. Uh, we worked on a little... Well, we made a little bit of progress on our upcoming short film on the Epic Zacco channel. Which is my other channel where I do really cool short film... Or really cool superhero action short films and stuff. That are fully homemade. I edit them, I film them. And we just had a really great time. So, check that channel out if you want to see those. But, we're not here to talk about that right now, are we? We are here to talk about Sonic the Freaking Hedgehog Free and Knuckles. This awesome game and this level with awesome music. And awesome aesthetics. And yeah, I, I really like the way this level looks and sounds. Uh, I'm not the biggest fan of the level design here, to be honest, though. It's not the worst, but it's not really the best either. It's just kind of meh for me. I like it a lot better in Sonic Mania. Um, but here, you know, it's kind of... I feel like this level doesn't have as great a flow as some of the other ones do. Uh, lots of spikes that can blindside you, and, um... You know, lots of places where you can get crushed and stuff. So it's not my favorite, but I do still like it. It's a fun level to run through. Um, certainly not a difficult level by any means. Not super difficult, at least. And I definitely absolutely love the soundtrack in this level. There's a little sample of it for you right there. Uh, but Act 2, well, well, we'll get to that when we get to it. Um, something crazy happened at the end of this level, though. Last episode, I don't know if you remember, I mentioned the Recorder's Curse. It's a curse where... Things that you're normally good at in a game when you're playing casually, you'll suddenly be absolutely god-awful at when you try to record yourself playing. And, just to let you know, this is, you'll see it. You'll see it later on. I'll, I'll tell you what it is, but you'll see it. Because the recorder's curse is definitely a real thing, and it definitely befell me at the end of this level. <laughs> at the end of this act. In fact, it's right here. Okay, so this guy, I like to call him Mr. Why Are You Hitting Yourself? That's what I call him, because that's what he does. But, believe it or not, this never happens normally, because he's normally an easy boss. I got myself freaking killed. By that guy, the boss that hits himself. <laughs> and now I have to fight him with no rings. So, yeah. <laughs> that happened. Super tough fight here, guys. No, it's super easy. Look at this. All you do is you wait. Spin Nash out of the way and he hits himself. And you just do that eight times and the boss is done. It's like the easiest boss fight in the world. Well, not really. There's easier ones. But I cannot believe I got myself killed by this thing. It was so funny that I just had to leave it in. I guess getting it, that extra life when we beat it kind of makes up for it just a little bit. But now get ready for... Awesome freaking Music Zone Act 2! So for those of you who don't know or haven't noticed yet... This game kind of started something that the first two games didn't have. And that's that Act 2 has a nice little remix of the music from Act 1. Every Act 2 has a... So, every zone actually comes with two themes. 
And I generally prefer the Act 2 music for most of these zones. And this zone especially. I really like Act 2's music here. And like I said, I'm not the biggest fan of the level design in this level, but it's still a very iconic stage. And like I said, still a lot of fun to run through. Just not quite as much fun as some of the other levels in the game. There's certainly levels that are worse than this too as well, and we'll get to that in the next part. <laughs> lots of lots of shields in this level too which are fun to pick up there are lots of good uses for them because you know there's like a lot of fire you can go through lots of rings to pick up with the electric shield Those spikes just always blindside me though, because you'll be. They always put them at the end of slopes, so you'll just be spin dashing, and the next thing you know, boom, spike. This comes from off screen. And those things can crush you if you stay on it a little bit too long. That's why I always spin dash when I'm on them. Those little screw things that slowly go up and down. I'll like spin dash when I'm on them so that I can get off as, like at the last second. Pretty fun, makes me feel like Indiana Jones or something. <laughs> makes me feel like Sonic. <laughs> As IGN would say, this game makes you feel like Spider-Man, I mean Sonic. I don't know where I was going with that joke. <laughs> okay. But in Act 2, we infiltrate Eggman's ship a little bit deeper. And you'll notice there's a bit of a theme going on in this level with the ship kind of destroying itself. But we'll get to that in a second. First, I'm going to get into this special stage over here on the left. Right now. No? Uh, that, that, you didn't see that. Hang on. Okay, I'm gonna get into the special stage on the left right now. I am going to get in the special stage on the left right now. Yes, I did it. First try. See guys, aren't I such a great gamer? Got into that special stage first try, beat the act one boss first try. Nobody messes with Knuckles. <laughs> so here we are in yet another Blue Sphere special stage. Like I said before, these are some of my favorites in the series. Probably my second favorite, actually. I have not yet played the 3D Blast Saturn special stages yet, because I, I did hear those are really good as well. Um, probably not as good as Mania's, but um, I did hear those are really good. But... You know, I'll get around to that eventually. I did finally get a Saturn, actually. Something I've been, like, on and off about getting. But I finally got it. Problem is, it's kind of a rare console, sort of. And there's not a lot of ports of the games. Like, there's ports of Sonic R, but the other games, not really. So the games are kind of expensive on eBay. They can go from, like, 50 to 100 bucks. Almost the same as, like, a buying a full price game that just came out now it's crazy and the chaos emerald i mean the super emerald is color coded to the special stage hooray this thing that nobody else cares about except me is is happening <laughs> but yeah so that was the green super emerald we're getting we're getting there we've only got about half of them left and we will have that epic reward that I won't spoil yet but here's what I mean about this this level just having a theme of all of, of just Eggman's machines destroying the ship or destroying itself because the act one boss destroyed itself and now this is a giant laser that is destroying the ship. Eggman, you you idiot. 
You... IQ of 300 my ass. <laughs> and this gets annoying on subsequent playthroughs because it's so easy. And, you know, you just got to go through it every time. You're kind of locked in that room. But oh no, the ship. It's crawling up on us. I almost got crushed there. That was a close one. And yeah, you got to be real fast in this section so you don't get crushed by the floor that's coming up. And now you just kind of wait for it to raise up to the real boss fight of this zone. And, uh, it doesn't destroy itself, but it's funny for another reason. Uh, yeah, um, Eggman, listen, listen, buddy, uh, you might want to work on the, you might want to work on the design of your ships, because, you know, it, look, it looks a little bit, it looks like a dick, okay? Your ship looks like a penis with two balls, and uh, HR is not going to be pleased about that. Corporate is not going to be pleased about that, so <laughs> you might want to work on that, buddy. But anyway, <laughs> that is the end of Act 2 and the end of this part, I believe. Yes. So thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this part, and I will be back next week with the next part. This is Knuckles. Have a great week.